Stoke City striker Sado Berahino says the eight-week drugs ban he served earlier this season came after his drink was spiked in a nightclub. Barahino did not play for former club West Brom between September and January, when he joined Stoke for £12 million. To be banged for something you really haven't done is hard to take, the 23-year-old told BBC's Football Focus. He claims the level of drugs found was really low, which he says proves there was no intent on his behalf. You go on a night out, you don't know who you are around and there are people who are out to get you, said the former England under-21 international. Of course, I was in a nightclub, so I hold my hand up for being irresponsible. From then on it all crashed down. To this day, I still cannot understand who would want to do that to me. Barahino brought an end to his turbulent time at the Hawthorns, by signing a five and a half year deal at Stoke on the 20th of January. The Albion Academy graduate, who scored 20 goals in 45 appearances for the club in 2014-15, threatened to go on strike after Spurs had a bid for him turned down on transfer deadline day in summer 2015. He returned to the site 10 days, after tweeting his frustration, but failed to regain his previous form. He continued to be linked with other Premier League clubs, but moves in the next two transfer windows failed to materialize. Berahino, who turned down three new contract offers from Albion, said he wanted to leave the club he joined as a 11-year-old because he hated the place. I was depressed, he said. Every morning I walked in the training ground I didn't want to be there. Going from loving something and hating the place that has made you is hard to take. Hate is a strong word, but I really didn't want to be there. That is one of the reasons I didn't sign the contracts they put on the table. It was not about money, it was about my happiness. 